Hi guys, so um, I read this week Dozer's Run by Debbie Levy and Rosanna Panza, illustrated by David Opie, and it was written in 2004, and um, it's actually based on a true story. So Dozer's Run is about a dog named Dozer, and his best friend Chica love to play in the yard before breakfast and hang out and stuff, but they're not supposed to leave the yard. So one day, they're playing in the yard and they see a bunch of runners going by and Dozer gets really excited and enthusiastic so he decides he's gonna follow the runners even though he's not supposed to leave the yard. So throughout the run these runners are running towards something obviously and Dozer just cannot wait to find out what he's gonna get you know at the end of the line you know he's convincing himself that it's gonna be this great treat or you know all this praise and it's this amazing thing at the end so through the run it ends up being a half marathon and he is a super friendly dog he's encouraging the runners to continue on keep going um, you know when they get tired and stuff and then finally when they finish the race everyone gets a medal and um, celebrates except for Dozer so he's kind of sad he ends up returning home but he's so far away that it takes him all night because he hasn't had any food and he's just completely exhausted from running this 13 miles so eventually he makes it home but it takes like overnight until the next day so his family was really worried but when he comes back they feed him and he rests i think for two days and so he feels a lot better. So all the runners end up getting together and talking about this amazing dog. So the men that put on the run end up coming to the house, Dozer, they find out where he lives, and they present him with an award. And it turns out they were running to raise money for cancer in this town. And people were so encouraged by the videos and posts that the runners had put about this amazing dog that he ended up raising $25,000 for cancer research, which is great. But this book was really encouraging for children. I feel like it encourages them to stay positive and to be driven and focused and continue on their path. Although I also think that on the other hand, it is good for them. They learn to listen to, you know, their parents or whatever. Like, don't leave the yard. It's probably for a good reason because you're going to get lost and, you know, be hungry all night or whatever, you know. So, yeah, I thought this book was really great. And it, uh, Dozer demonstrates a lot of good characteristics that I think would be very beneficial for children to learn. Um... Yeah, so that's the book. Thank you.